St. Paul police are looking for the person who shot and killed a family dog while robbing their home. Police say this is the person who broke into the home on the city's northeast side. The homeowner told our Adam Duxter that what was taken can never be replaced. St. Paul police want you to take a good look at this person. It's who they say broke into a Margaret Street home yesterday morning, stealing an assault rifle along with thousands of dollars in silver, but also taking something homeowner Tony Kiris says can never be returned. Um, I lost my best friend. His dog, Max, shot and killed by the intruder. He was uh, almost 10 years old, never hurt a soul. The dog was a golden retriever, just perfect, perfect dog. And a companion, he says, never would have posed a threat. Harmless, uh, just a beautiful dog. Um, you couldn't ask for a more gentle, kinder dog. He never left my side. I'm sure he didn't even do anything to this gentleman. He just probably was in his way and maybe tired of practice, I don't know. Well, Kira says he's never seen this person before. He hopes their distinct features, including a tattoo on their cheek and hand, means someone has. St. Paul police say any tip helps. Would you want this to happen to your pet or your someone who you love, you know, unconditionally? But I don't want to see this happen to anybody else's dog or, fa or family member. Um, I just hope he gets what he deserves. In St. Paul, Adam Duxter, WCCO 4 News. You can get a closer look at that surveillance uh, footage on WCCO.com. St. Paul Police say call 651-266-5867 if you have any information.